There's a queue outside the front door since 5.30 this morning. Yeah, is that guess, typical? It's crazy. There's the two girls down there. Their name's June and the other one's called um, Samantha. And they came all the way from Singapore on a 20-hour 20, 20 flight. And but I think, right I, I think it's insane, okay, to think that like um, we got such dedicated fans here in Cork and from like all over the world. And so. I think it's that like lots of fans come down from Dublin as well because it's kind of like a trip for them to kind of, they had like two cars like follow us all the way down just here. There's fans down there who just like just heard about it from more than mouth and there's like fans here from like down there who are from Russia, from Norway and from like Sweden and from like Singapore as well. So that's really cool. And, we're, and But it's really great that we're, we're, we brought like, a, a cor- they're all down here in Cork so it's really, really great. Okay. Eurovision looked like a lot of fun for you, was it? Yeah, I think being an, being an, Azerbaijan was really, really cool. We had so much fun. It was a really, really Jepic, another Jepic moment for me and Edward. And we had so much fun doing it. I think Eurovision was like a really, it was like a big national event where everyone was like, whoa, Jepic are representing Ireland. And I think everyone got behind us. And we got like the highest TV ratings for Eurovision, like ages. I think it was like 1.5 million for the semi-final. I think the final was even more. Answer me this. What's the best country you've been to in Europe? The best country, well, if Cork was a country, then we'd say that, but it's not a country, it's in Ireland. But um, the best country that we've been to in Europe, we, I think they're all, they're all cool. What's the best? I don't want to say any country because they're all listening to this right now. Yeah, I think they're all really, really cool and unique in their own way. They're all good. They're all cool. Do fans send stuff into you? Yes, the shoes we're wearing right now are made by these Swedish fans. Yeah, our fans are really creative. They're really I think it's cool because they get excited when we wear something they've made and then the, the rest of the fans want to make us something. So they give us lots of ties, lots of T-shirts, lots of like... Shirts, different. jackets, and they give us like loads of cool things from our fans. And they make lots of posters and they come up with loads of good ideas that like we could like do ourselves. For anybody who wants to jettify themselves, give us a top five tips. Jacket. Okay, you got to wear an outfit that really stands out and doesn't blend in with the scenery around you. So if you're wearing like like real dull colours, then you kind of blend in. So you you got to wear kind of real solid colours, a cool tie, a cool shirt, cool jeans. And you just got to have a cool attitude. You got and own it as well. Whatever, okay. Lots of people wear dark colours, okay, but so it's okay. Yes, yeah, no big deal. Just wear a cool pair of jeans. Yeah. Okay. Tell us, what's the best thing you've done so far? The best thing we've done so far is just being ourselves, being being like out there performing, having real positive music. And we're really excited because we're on our third album. We had Plant Jared, Victory, and now Young Love just came out. Our fans really, really like it. They like all the songs. And I feel like me and Eric, we're always progressing in music. We're always like like on stage in the market. I was singing um, a cappella, Boyfriend and Guitar, which is really, really cool. I think like doing Eurovision, a kind of Olympic torch, meeting Barack Obama, being on Cor- Cork's 96 FM, which is really cool. Best moment. But um, we, we're always going to have really, really best moments. It's about making the moments yourself. So everyone listening, you make your memories your moments so everyone get out there and make really cool memories and moments this year have a cool summer either of you have comfort foods you love yeah i like grapes yeah my comfort food i love i love bananas i love strawberries i love drinking water i think drinking water is the most coolest drink you can drink because it has no taste it has nothing on it it's so pure and That's keeps you right. hydrated what's comfort foods you like edward um i love chocolate i love like ice cream no me and her like we like just eating healthy okay. what's your comfort food we a bit with butter on top what? what? What was the last album you listened to? The last album that me and I had listened to, well, I listened to, um, who did you listen to, Edward? I listened to Maroon 5, that was really cool. Yeah, their brand new album it was out. And I listened to Justin Bieber's new album. I listened to, it was really cool. I listened to, um, well, that's it, that's what I listened to so far. I listened to our brand new album, Young Love, which is out now. A fact from both of you that you have never, ever revealed before. Um, I don't usually use conditioner in my hair because it'll make my hair go too soft and I won't be able to spike it. A fact that no one knows about me is that I'm able to fly. A fact that no one knows about me now is that me now, we always do our own Twitter. Other celebrities don't ever do their own Twitter. Our Twitter's at Plant Jedder and we always do our own tweets. We're really like dedicated to our fans. Do you have like a superstition, something you always do before you go on stage? Before we go on stage, Kay, we always change our socks and change our underwear that we're wearing and we change our skinny jeans and we always are really, really fresh going on stage. We drink loads and loads of water to keep ourselves hydrated. When we're going out on stage, we go out there, we Jeez. just go crazy. We, 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 we do front flips, we do so much energy and we really get into the audience because everyone's so excited to see you in concert and you just got to be as excited as them and make it even more exciting. John and Edward, Edward, thank you so much. Okay, I'm John, he's Aaron, together we are Jed and we are here on Cork's 96 FM. <laughs> Crazy guy for the